Okay, this is my second flower experiment. I have three similar sunflowers here with a time-lapse camera set up over here. The first flower will not be grounded. The second flower will be outlet grounded, meaning that there's a earthing grounding cable from the vase that leads to this electrical cord, which has a grounding port, and it's grounded to this outlet here. And the third flower is grounded to a stake outside using a 14 gauge copper wire. In my previous experiment, I had two vases and I showed that the grounded flowers had better results and lasted longer than the ungrounded flowers. So in this case, I'm trying to show if there's a difference in outlet grounded versus a grounding rod grounded cut flower. So this is a voltmeter and it's set on alternating current. And you can see that when I test the first flower, the voltage jumps up to above 600 millivolts. The second flower, which is outlet grounded, is about 55 millivolts. And the third flower, it is roughly 39 millivolts AC. So already the grounding rod flower has less voltage through it than the flower that is grounded by the outlet using an earthing cord that has a 100,000 ohm resistor. So let's let these flowers grow in this EMF field of roughly 45 volts per meter or greater electric field. And we'll see what happens in about two weeks.